Hello YouTube, just picked this up at the post office. New digging trowel. Treasure wise. I ordered this right from the company that sells on Amazon. I can't give you the actual name. It, it, I'll probably give you the wrong name. It could be the, the detector experts. Uh, but you'll find it on Amazon. What I did is I found the company order direct from them. First class postage had it in three days with free shipping. So that was a no brainer. Okay. So, if you order free shipping on Amazon, it could be a week or more. This is sharpened this way. These are your teeth that dig your roots. 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 About two inches wide, a little over six inches long. We are going to sharpen this side only, like a knife. And we'll be putting the knife edge, being they sharpen this way, we'll put the knife edge here. So, we'll maybe use my knife sharpening machine, maybe not. Just depends because that's pretty wide to stick in there. But uh, looks like this has some spray coating sprayed over it. So I see where that's made. It says Inox Italy. Really nice and hefty. The the handle's what got me. Now I found these on Amazon like for gardening and they got a nice wooden handle. But no, I like this. It's like a pirate. Yar, ar. It's R, not yar. Here you go. Got to add some humor in here. It's gonna be a short video. Okay. Give you a little quick view. So you can find this on Amazon. So uh, let's pause. We'll show you the next item. Okay, I said this like twenty two bucks. If you get a sheath, it's probably thirty bucks. I don't need a sheath. I hang it on a lanyard. This is a brass probe. If you're in real nice parks and school places or someone's yard, uh, you'll poke this down and feel the coin. Suppose I've never done it. Okay. Then there, I, there's you, plenty of YouTube videos. You can type this in here. You'll find this exact probe. Even though I don't own a Garrett. Ain't that pretty? That, that's what caught my attention. Old school. See that clearing? I, you know I like old school stuff. And that's probably $6 more with a brass. Well, this is probably 12 bucks. Average, 11 to 12 bucks. This is about five and a half inches long, if I remember right on my ruler. We'll go like six inches. Yeah, there's the six inch mark down there by my thumb. The thing is, you go down and find your coins, you know, in the dirt. And that's not real sharp, so you don't damage it. I mean, you can actually, I probably will round this off a little more so it's not as pointed. You're not really jabbing nothing in a coin. But I've seen people take a screwdriver, which I don't want to do. I might make a brass thing with another handle, screwdriver handle, uh, kind of flatten like a little screw, so I can get in there and lift the coin up. Because I've taken my, uh, like a hunting knife before, and I actually pop coins out. I, in parks, I'm clad with quarters, I'm mostly clad. I just and went down and went like this and popped the quarter out of the ground. I got that good at it, not to brag. But there you go. Leave some pictures. Way too long a video for these two little items. Hope I didn't leave anything out. Uh, look at my description, and I'll put the actual company that I got these from. So in case I told you wrong. But thanks for watching.